Have you ever wondered what goes into making a grant? Let's follow the journey of a dollar at the Signatory. It all starts with a contribution to a donor-advised fund in order to provide the dollars for charitable giving. Contribute through the method of your choice to start the process. If your contribution is electronic, like through a credit card or a linked bank, it goes through the payment processor and they deduct their fees. Your receipt, for tax purposes, will still be for the full amount of your contribution. If you contribute a paper check or asset like publicly traded securities, our team will manually process your contribution once we receive the funds and your contribution notification form. At this stage, your contribution will display as pending in the fund. Once the funds have gone through the payment processor, they are then sent to the signatory from your banking institution. From there, we reconcile the dollars into the fund and its investment pools based on your recommended investment instructions. This involves several steps for us to batch, match, post, and move the dollars. After the dollars have gone through this process, the contribution status will display as complete, a contribution receipt email will be sent to the donor, and the contribution will now show up in the available balance. This is the balance you can use for recommending grants. Now that you are ready to recommend a grant, you can go through the online platform to submit the request. First, open the New Grant form. Next, find the charity, add any notes, and submit the grant request. Once your request has been submitted, it is added to our processing queue. In the due diligence stage, we check for several items. First, we check that the charity is approved. If it is not approved or its approval has expired, we will move the charity into a vetting process. Next, we check that the fund has an adequate balance for the grant amount. If your contribution status is not complete, there may not be sufficient funds to process a grant, so the grant will remain on hold until your contribution is processed. Lastly, we review the grant purpose notes and any special instructions for its processing. With those steps completed, we then move the grant to a final review, ensuring all details are set up correctly. Now that the grant recommendation has been reviewed and approved, we are ready to pay the grant. We first will divest the money from our investment pools in order to fund the grant. This might take additional time if the fund is using an advisor-managed account where the advisor will need to process the request and send funds. The funds will then be sent by wire, ACH, or mailed out by check, depending on which method the charity has set up. Grants sent via ACH will be deposited the same day or the next day into the charity's account. Grants larger than $100,000 sent via ACH will be sent the next day due to a federal limit on anything over this amount. Checks will be printed and mailed, and their delivery will be dependent on the current USPS mailing times. Once the check or ACH has been initiated, the grant status will update to paid, and after our internal final reconciliation of numbers, it will display as complete. Your generosity is on its way to impact. Thank you for choosing the signatory for your generosity journey.